Hey guys, welcome to the clubhouse. I'm Billy Jackson, and today's review is going to be on A Quiet Place Part 2. Now, let me say, start this whole thing off saying, I friggin' love the first A Quiet Place. I mean, it's in my top 10 favorite horror movies of all time. It's amazing. Did this sequel disappoint? No, not at all. This sequel was awesome. I mean, I was in the theater literally white-knuckled the whole entire movie. And it's a quick movie, and I, I like that. It was only an hour and a half. It seemed like ten minutes had gone by. You know, it, it ends abruptly, kind of like the first one did. But I'm fine with that, because I wasn't expecting it, and it left me wanting more. I want another sekel to this, so please, John Krasinski, make another one because you are an amazing director. This movie was awesome. I have one little nitpick that I'll get to in a little while, but that's it. As far as sequel goes, it, it ranks up there with like Empire Strikes Back, you know, Terminator 2, you know, some of the best sequels, you know, to a good franchise ever made. But this ranks right up there. I mean, and let me say, I love how this movie begins. And it's not a spoiler or anything because it's in the trailer. You know, you it begins before the first movie started. So you kind of see what happens to the, to the family, you know, before the events of the first movie and how they kind of got to where they were. And, you know, and it's not very, you know, it's just the first act and the second act pretty much picks up right after the first movie, and I thought that was brilliant, because, you know, from the first movie, you don't know where these creatures come from, you know, you don't know really anything about them, you just know as much as the family knows, you know, that you just got to be quiet, because if you don't, you're liable, one noise and bam, you're going to be dead, and, you know, five seconds later, because they're fast, and they can hear you from a long ways away, so, anyway, man, this movie had so many jump scares and had me literally jumping out of my seat multiple times throughout this whole entire movie. And I found myself like this. For about halfway through the movie, I was like this. Like, I, I in disbelief about what I just saw. And I couldn't believe that, you know, that they went there in some scenes that they actually went in a direction that I didn't think that they were going to go, and it surprised me, and it was brilliant. I uh, wasn't disappointed at all. Great writing, great directing, great visuals. Just, it was awesome, guys. I, and I don't know what to tell you, except for go and see this movie. If you like the first Quiet Place, now, I do believe that the, the first Quiet Place is better than this, but that's not saying anything bad about this movie. Um, the only nitpick that I had about this was that it kind of jumps around. It's kind of almost telling three stories at one time. And it didn't ruin the movie for me at all. I just kind of wish they would have focused on one of those stories and kind of kept people together. But I understand why they did what they did. I get it. Because multiple things are going on and they want to show you all these things. But it kind of jumped around a little bit. And... I, and that's the only thing I think about this movie that I really didn't like. And, and that's nothing. I mean, that's that. like I said, it's just a minor nitpick. It did not ruin the movie for me. I just wish they would have done it a different way. But it still turned out excellent. So, guys, get your family together. I mean, it's not a family movie. <laughs> but get your gang together, whoever you take to the theaters. So you want to go see a good horror movie, this is the one to do it with. You know, so go, go out and do it. Just be safe, be careful, and just go enjoy yourselves, guys. That's what it's all about, trying to get the pandemic behind us and move forward. So go and support this movie. Let it make a lot of money so they can make more because they need to make more. The end of this movie, I'm telling you, abrupt ending. I was ready. I could have watched another hour and a half, you know, because it was so amazing. But anyway... That's my thoughts on it, but what are your thoughts on it? Have you seen A Quiet Place 2? Do you plan on seeing it? 
let me know in the comments below. Remember to like my videos and subscribe to my channel. And as always, make yourself happy every day. And the only way to do that is to remember, the only thing stopping you is you stopping. Bam!